Hey, hey, it's Rob today and Teddy. And we both have a very cool hack for you today for the Denneke time code slate. Here it is. This is the TSC, the compact version of the time code slate. It's a fabulous product, of course. Use it every day. The only thing that's not so fabulous is inside here. This thing here. Come on out, you bastard. All right. So this battery sled thing here is pretty much the worst thing that's ever been invented by the mind of man. There is just no way to get these batteries in and out of here easily. Literally, you need a tool, you need to pry it apart. This is the only one I can get out, of course, because this is already busted. This tab broke today, and so I can get this side of it out. But the other side, forget it, literally. I mean, you got to jam a screwdriver in there or something or other. It takes forever. So, we've all established this thing is horrible. What else do we do uh, instead of use that thing? Well... Somebody figured out a little while back, you can use, hey, a nine volt battery. Free plug for Amazon here. So, easy enough. Open the sled. Open the door, I mean, and pop in the uh, nine volt, like so. And look at that, fires right up. So, that's beautiful. And that'll work great. Here we go, here comes our code and lights up and everything but of course that doesn't work so well so we need to find a way to secure that nine volt inside of the slot and i saw someone else try this kind of thing the other day and they used a stick like this but then you got to carry a stupid stick like this you got to cut it down to size this one ain't gonna fit etc 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 so i thought to myself why don't we just use more batteries so one two three nine volts fit in the hole we're still running here but again still a little loose gonna wobble around i'm gonna lose my connectivity with the three nine volts even in there so what will we do in its stead all right here's where the brilliant part comes in we're gonna use a piece of Bubba 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 Gum. Indeed, it's squishy. It'll kind of fit itself right in the slot there. Uh, let's see, not that way. How did I do this before? Yeah, that way. All right, and squeeze it in a little bit there till we get the cover closed. It's hard to do with one hand, but believe me, you can do it. And once I get that in there, look at that. Shake it around. Working perfectly. So. Three 9 volt batteries and a piece of hubba bubba bubble gum. Say that five times fast. And you got yourself a slate that you do not have to power with this stupid thing. So, what are the disadvantages? Uh, 9 volt batteries are basically six uh, quadruple A cells. So, you've got double A's, of course, triple A's. And what's inside a 9 volt battery is just six quadruple A cells in. Uh, series so they'll probably last maybe i don't know a third as long the batteries are about a third the size of a double a battery so you'll get a third of the use out of there but with two other nine volts in there you'll get about the same amount as this now of course once the nine volt dies you're gonna have to open the thing up pop out your bubble gum and you know swap out the battery and put the one in the back and the front etc etc that's gonna take way less time than dealing with this thing and the other bonus is, if you get hungry, you got a piece of delicious uh, strawberry watermelon hubba bubba bubble gum. Go enjoy at your leisure when you're not wasting your time putting double batteries, double A batteries in this thing. All right. Well, that's all I got for you today. Signing off. Bye-bye.